Welcome to Mother Daughter Projects. I'm Steph. I'm Vicki. And we're just out here hanging out on our new bench. About three weeks ago, we saw that there was an Instagram builders challenge and they were building a bench. And we thought, well, we could do that. So we decided to commit to doing the project in three weeks and we decided to make it into a bench slash privacy screen. Mm -hmm. We had another little challenge on top of that. Mom had cataract surgery, so which is no big deal, except you can't do heavy lifting for one week per eye. So we had that extra challenge, but we were able to get it done. One of the accommodations we made because I couldn't lift was to cast three pieces of concrete rather than one large piece from the bench because we thought Steph can move that and I wouldn't have to help her. Mm -hmm. So join us as we show you how we put this bench together. Our first step was to modify Anna White's original plan. We made the bench six feet tall, added privacy lattice, and decided to use three concrete slabs of seats. Check out our website for a complete materials and tools list. We started by building the base of the bench. We measured all our pieces and cut them on the miter saw. We're using nine pressure treated two by fours. To connect the base together, we're gonna to use pocket holes. We laid out our wood and marked where we're gonna drill the holes. We use a Craig jig to create the pocket holes. We laid out the base and attached the sides, then positioned the middle supports equally. We followed Anna White's plan almost exactly, except we added two extra supports in the middle. We glued and screwed the middle supports together. Then we attached the middle supports with pocket holes. Next, we cut the grooves where the lattice will sit. To cut the grooves, we clamped two boards together. One acted as a guide and the other was the one we cut. We use our circular saw attached to the Craig rip cut jig. We did four passes on each board that needed grooves. There's a lot of ways we could have made these grooves in the wood, but we wanted to use tools that we already had. So our battery powered circular saw and our rip cut from Craig worked really well to get nice straight lines every time. We cleaned up each groove and used a 1 8 inch chisel to get any remaining wood out of the groove. Next we sanded all the pieces. Then we primed with an outdoor primer and finished with a gray outdoor paint. Next we assembled the back of the frame. One of the tools we really like is a speed square. It's a very simple tool, but it's great for making accurate lines. And I like that you can slip it underneath a tape measure and really get an accurate measurement. One of the must have tools for this project was the Craig jig. It helps us make pocket holes, which allows us to join wood together. And we've tried doing this without pocket holes and it was, it was a challenge. So pocket holes were the way to go for this for sure. We measured and cut our lattice to fit snugly into the groove. We found that tin snips work fine to cut the plastic lattice. We shimmy the lattice into place and attach the remaining back pieces. We put the base into place and glued it. Then we attach metal brackets for extra support. For even more support, we added three more screws. We wanted to make sure the weight of the concrete was not an issue for this bench. We attached the front legs by leveling it with the bottom legs. We glued and screwed this into place. We raised the bench and filled the back pocket holes with Bondo and sanded once dry. The four feet we covered with Flex Seal, which is a paintable rubber. 
We thought this would add extra protection to where the bench meets the ground. Once everything was dry, we brought it to the backyard and added the three concrete slab seats. What, what we learned. learned. The first thing we learned was we were using pressure treated wood and that's treated with chemicals so you have to be a little extra careful with that. We were be sure to wear gloves and we were sure to wear eye protection and masks when we were sanding. We learned even more about concrete in this project when we made these three bench seats. So we learned so much we're going to put that in a whole nother video so be sure to check that out. One thing we found out that we didn't know that they have two different kinds of lattice. Mm -hmm. They have a regular lattice and this some um, smaller privacy screen lattice. And one thing I learned that's completely off topic is if we if we live long enough, we'll all get cataracts in our eyes. So fun fact for all of you. But Ma, how are your eyes doing? Oh, my eyes are great. I can see so much clearer and especially at night. And that's actually the reason why I went and had them done. Mm -hmm. So if you like this video and want to see more from us, be sure to hit the subscribe button below. And you also see a little bell icon. If you click that, you'll get notifications when we post a video. Yeah. Mom, how are your eyes? My eyes are good. Your eyes are doing good? They're doing very good. Can you see clearly now? I can see clearly now. She can see clearly oh. now. The fog is gone. Goodbye. Hey, go back. We're not done.